Hello, so welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I appreciate your love and support. Today we are going to find out who is thinking heavily about you right now and why. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading. It will not resonate with each and every one of you. Okay, Cancer, Spirits and Angels, please show me. Who is thinking heavily about Cancer right now and why? Wow. This person is thinking about telling you about their past, okay? Six of Cups here in love first. There are two different groups of you. One group's Cancer. This person, mm, I feel like they would like to tell you the truth here, okay? With Ace of Swords, clarify something in regards of their past. Six of Cups in love first. Or... Another group of you, it will be clarifying something that may have, may have happened between the two of you in the past, okay? And seven of wands here, they also could be talking, uh, wanting to talk to you in regards of fighting for this connection. They're thinking about that. This person could be a Taurus, could be any fixed signs. Strong Aries I'm seeing here. Can also be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Can be any sign, okay? But I feel like Cancer, this person also wants to talk to you in regards of getting married, taking the relationship to the next level. And Ace of Pentacles is here, wanting to have this new beginning with you. And look, we've got Eight of Swords here. So this person has been thinking and thinking and thinking <laughs> a lot, uh, a lot for sure. Little Fortune here, take. Uh, this chance, okay? I don't know, either if you're separated from this person, they may um, be thinking about asking for a second chance, okay? But the Wheel of Fortune, if this is somebody you are connecting with currently and everything, you know, not all relationships are perfect, but I feel like there's this energy of this person is thinking heavily in regards to make it, taking a different path with you, make some like big changes in your connection you're thinking about proposing to you as well ace of pentacles if both of you are not married uh proposing to you or it could be offering a commitment here ten of pentacles is right here cancer this person is thinking about the future with you thinking heavily in regards of the future with you whether it, it is to reconcile if you both are separated or take the relationship again to the next level But there's something that needs to be hashed uh, out. They, both of you need to hash some things out. Six of Cups here. And what verse? Whether it's them, I don't know. I'm just getting whether this, this if this is someone new, they want to tell you the truth about their childhood or something that may have happened to them in the past. And then, but they are worried that you may or may not accept it. Eight of Swords here. But, they, but they're going to offer you something here anyway with the Ace of Pentacles. And with the Emperor here and well first, they know that by doing so, by telling you something, the truth here, about something in the past here, maybe it's like they are losing they will lose control over the entire situation, but at the same time they feel like this is the right thing to do. I don't know, I just feel like cancer the two groups of you. One, if you're separated, this person is thinking about reconciliation, having the second chance with you and wants to talk to you in regards to that. This person may be somebody who could be giving you some bad memories here. Six of Cups in reverse and seven of wands is right here. This may be someone that you're trying to protect yourself from. Maybe this person has taken advantage of you or um, with the Emperor in reverse, taken advantage of you or could have taken you for granted as well this person is thinking about reaching out yeah ace of pentacles offer you commitment and or an apology or something of value okay so two different groups of you if this is someone relatively new again cancer it just feels like this person wants to tell you something about their past but they're worried about telling you their past because they're afraid that you might reject them right hmm. let's see more cancer Got the King of Wands here, Ten of Wands. Mm. 
This person is keeping an eye on you and ten of ones. It feels like to talk to you with a with the ace of swords here, ten of ones is really hard for them to to finally want to talk to you and clarify something to you or tell you the truth. It's it's really hard for them actually. They're thinking about doing that, but at the same time they feel really stuck, right? With eight of swords here. And also we've got the world here in reverse. That means they uh this person is feeling stuck. And also again if this is someone you're separated from, they still haven't moved on yet and this could be the reason why they could be thinking heavily about you right now. And two of swords here is in reverse. I sense them wanting to make a choice. They are going to make a choice or thinking about making a choice to ask for a second chance. And if this is somebody completely new, they I feel like they could have some baggages from their past, okay? Whether it's a family, children, or they were married before, or it could be some childhood trauma, okay? Can be anything. Black Cancer, this person wants to talk to you about that. They want to tell you everything in regards to their past. They feel like this could be the right thing to do. This is the right thing for them to do. And King of Wands here, this person may be a fire sign. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Two of Wands. Yeah, so they are kind of indecisive, standing at the crossroad here, waiting to take actions, thinking about talking to you here. But they're indecisive, right? They're not sure if they should or shouldn't. I feel like they'll make a decision here. Okay, two of swords here in reverse also can indicate should they make a decision to tell you or should they just leave it be? <laughs> That's what I'm getting. Three of swords here is in reverse. This person may, may have hurt you in the past and vice versa. But this may also indicate healing and recovery. So this person is thinking about healing or recovering this connection if both of you are separated, okay? Although they want to tell you in regards to something that may have happened to them again, Three of Swords here. It's like something that may have hurt them, something from their past, I don't know. Two groups of you can say, yeah, one group is someone from your past, another group of you is someone you could be currently connected with, relatively new. Or both of you could have been dating for a while, but then this person hasn't told you yet something about their past, okay? So we've got the Eight of Cups here, Seven of Pentacles, and also we've got the Sun. Mm, this person is just waiting and observing. Waiting and observing to illuminate everything, to make everything clear to you. Eight of Cups. Yeah, they're not sure. They feel like if they were to tell you whatever it is, the truth, you may walk away from them. Yep. Yeah. Alright, Cancer, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. If you're interested, check it out. And the second one, second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done. Um, and they're all very new because I post your videos very often. So there are different topics, different questions, different messages. Just click on the second playlist and scroll all the way down and look for your sign. Okay, Cancer? And also I'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me. My information is in the description box below. And also if you'd like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Alright, take care, Cancer. Bye.